into the roar, running headfirst into fear. You probably learned about lions in school at one point or another. And you were probably surprised to find out when you were younger that the male lions actually don't do much of the hunting. It's actually the female lions that do almost all the hunting for the lions. Into the roar, charging head first at the thing you fear. You probably learned about lions in school at some point or another. And you can probably remember being surprised to learn that the male lions actually don't do much of the hunting. It's almost exclusively the females that do the hunting for the entirety of those, that lion pack. Now, the interesting thing is that when a female lion is hunting down a gazelle, it actually stalks the gazelle and pushes it towards the male lion. The only job of the male lion in this entire hunting scenario is to stand up and roar with everything it has. When it does this, most of the gazelles hear that roar, see that male lion, and they turn and they run straight into the waiting claws of the female lions that are stalking and waiting for them to run, come right to them. The interesting part is, the gazelles that survive are the ones that fight this instinct to flee and run head first towards the male lion. Those are the ones that even in the face of fear, even in the roar, they continue to move forward. Here's a little motivational speak secret. I don't always feel like it. Sometimes when you feel like you just want to run away from it, when you don't want to train, when you just feel negative, when things feel like they're beating you down, that's when you have to turn and that's when it's the most important to trudge head first into the roar, get that training in, think positive, go out, get things done, when, especially when you don't want to, when you want to run away. That's when you have to put your head down and trudge head first into the roar.